Now, only clothing can get you frustrated, get you wound up, get you doing foolish stuff under the sun, looking all crazy, exhausted, you know, looking more foolish. What am I doing? Oh, my dear, this girl. She wasn't born of the earth. hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is ugo Induma. i'm sorry i'm squinting the sun is out the sun is out in today's video i'll be trying out all of chloe ting's 2020 summer shred workout like her program on the 2020 summer shred two weeks of summer shred i'm going to be trying them all out today all in one day all at once all at a go i might regret this <sighs> no, i think i'm going to regret this like i put on my glasses to like look at the program just to know if i'm seeing right and seeing if i can actually do it because i am so so unfit like did i say unfit i mean uh, i would like it to be a good challenge for me just to like push me and all that and i'm on all black for somebody mad I'm on all black, like the sun is out, I'm feeling hot, but at the same time, like I'm feeling hot, but I'm feeling like cool breeze. Do you understand? But then it's a beautiful day to be alive today, and I'm super super pumped. But at the same time, I'm super super afraid. But you know, I got this, I'm a big girl, you know. I used to be very, very strong. And Chloe thing got me to that point of being very, very strong right now i've blamed it a lot on covid but it's not covid it's me it's not you it's me and i accept that it's 151 so i just want to quickly start so that you know i can get this over with maybe by 3 30 or something and i think it's like an hour and 30 minutes and i'm super super pumped and her workout to now include some dumbbells which is actually good because last year's 2020 um last year's 2019 um two weeks summer shred didn't have any dumbbells so this would be fun so from what i can see she has two 11 minutes workout one 60 minutes and one 26 minutes so my strategy is to start with the 10 10 minutes then go to the 26 minutes and end it with the 60 minutes hey I don't hope it's a good strategy. I'm going to start with the upper body owned and do the abs, you know, get all the hard, hard ones out. Like the abs will be hard. So let's just get it over with. And I hate abs. Let's just get all those things over with. So let me begin with the first workout. And since the 10, 10 minutes on both of them are on the ground, it's just good. I just do it, get it over with, get my mouth out and like power through the longer ones. Ay, thinking about it even makes me stressed. Oh, oh this song is nice. I have not well, actually seen your I miss you. She looks so beautiful. Look at that girl. So why we die to Chloe Ting? Like, I just wanted to like start off the video out here and tell you this. I absolutely finished this challenge and then all through this challenge i know um i cut out some of those clips but all through as i was doing any, all this workout i just kept on telling myself you know you're going to finish strong and honestly speaking i can't believe like the power of words and just speaking over myself and just telling myself you know strong and positive things heck yes you've got this push 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 that's what i kept telling myself throughout the whole workout and it truly truly worked and i was able to finish this workout and honestly speaking i never thought i would finish it because i normally do start like all these workout challenges on my youtube channel and never get to finish it but then i finished it i was even able to do a bloody push-up like ah look at just look at look at that form it's in perfect form it's slow but it's in perfect form and i really told myself you know regardless of the fact that you're slowly doing this you are going to do this and i was sincerely proud of this girl right here and i just can't believe how i spoke over myself and spoke over my life literally my life because chloe ting literally make, made me beg for my life and beg for 
God to just come and take this away from me. I know how Jesus felt on the cross. I was like, God, take this cup away from me. But literally, I gave the cup to myself. Jesus had no choice. I had a choice. I chose death. Uh, so I just finished um, the first one. It was like upper body. <sighs> Honestly speaking, <sighs> I should have not done like some movements. Should have just done like the modifications of it. Like I obviously know I cannot do them, and I was just trying to do them, and it was just like taking my time because I could have just been doing the modifications. Um, properly and still getting like an effective workout and I was just there trying to you know do what she's doing rather than just following the modifications and you know following the modification doesn't mean you know I'm not strong or anything it just finishing the um, the workout makes me actually strong and not actually following her at her own pace but that one was good it was quite easy like not too easy but it was okay like my heart rate is up but I don't feel like collapsing or something like that well let's see the abs so i think i picked the right strategy <laughs> i think so i think so well um i'm going to like pace myself and just focus on doing the movement correctly rather than just you know being fast or something like that and whenever i need a rest i'm going to take a rest i'm just going to be easy on myself and just give myself grace honestly just give myself grace and just know that i have gigolos up and above and me coming back here conditioning myself to come back here is what will like get me fit and strong so i just have to like treat myself with more grace ah, but then the sun is really out like i can't even touch the house because it's that hot like it's hot. Uh, as we started the second workout all that went through my mind was why am i doing this like what's the essence of this like what are you doing and then it just dawned on me like i think many people actually feel like the way i feel or like maybe when i'm doing exercises i'm just telling myself what are you doing like this doesn't make any sense this doesn't work you're literally killing yourself over nothing and that's literally how i feel every morning i wake up to do a workout but then working out for me when i was doing this workout is really never about my physique or having a flat stomach and all that and all that maybe i would put it up in a title or something like that in the video but it's never about that for me it's about how i feel when doing the workout it's how strong i am is whenever i'm in this position of i want to give up and i come back like three seconds later or five seconds later or even 10 minutes later and condition myself to being there i know i sound as if i'm about to cry but trust me i'm an emotional wreck who else while walking out looks for excuses to like not do a particular movement maybe you're like i think there's a nail under my mat i don't know no, so i said it is actually red i started feeling as if there's pain in my palm but then i was like are you looking for an excuse or there's actually something in your palm like okay, maybe it's behind the mat there's nothing behind the mat and there's nothing in my palm it's just red i don't even know i don't even know <laughs> i guess i was just looking for an excuse and my god the glasses are off this is getting hard but we're down to the third workout and this is like the longest one i'm just going to pace myself truly truly pace myself so on the note of being an emotional wreck i'm also that kind of person that truly truly believes that i'm truly unstoppable and whenever i walk out i truly feel that i'm unstoppable especially when i'm able to finish a particular workout i truly feel like i can do anything and obviously my confidence should never come from a workout or how i look or anything but that's exactly how i feel i consistently look at myself while working out why even doing life
you guys the sun is doing wonders out there honestly i'm just going to stay inside the hot like there's there's a kidney here jesus christ my heart is even itching me god of god and it's pretty pretty dark okay that's why on my camera it's pretty pretty dark so i'm pretty i'm really 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 sorry but then in the car i think i'm going to have a sunburn like i feel dark already man oh it's so hot in the afternoon yesterday was so cool okay i'm trying to get more rest but hey i'm just going to stay inside and just power through I've only done six minutes of the third exercise, the third workout. Jesus Christ. And I'm dead already. Ah, oh, Laura Majer, this girl. Ah, she wasn't born of the eggs. Ah, she can't be. What? Make sure you're not arching or bending your back. Having a strong core also makes it easier to balance yourself here. So just take it slow and get your form right. Oh no, 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 how, 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 how? This is not natural. Oh my god, thank you for you too. That's not my own. God. Why is it that I eat and I get fat? Why? I. It's not fair. I just want to eat and enjoy, not the other way around. Oh my god. Okay. 30 minutes. I'm one minute above average. Above done. I can actually finish this. I can actually finish this. We'll not finish perfect, but we'll finish it. Just stand up. Just stand up. <laughs> My cup is even sweaty. Oh. Okay. You know what? Let us focus. And smash this. No complaining. Just finishing. Let's do this. Now, most of you have checked out on seeing me, you know, go through that emotional outburst and saying i can never be subscribed to somebody so angry so violent why is she so violent like but honestly i'm not violent i'm just expressing how i truly feel at the moment and i feel like it's very important that um when doing a workout or even doing life in general that whenever we feel an emotion whether it's anger you know frustration that you actually acknowledge those feelings and feel them and just feel them you know but then never let yourself leave that moment feeling those negative emotions is you know expressing your anger expressing your tired expressing that you don't want to do this but then at the same time reminding yourself of why you need to do this reminding yourself of the need to actually do this and coming back on the table and just telling yourself i'm going to quit complaining i'm going to keep at this and i'm going to absolutely finish strong and it doesn't really matter how you do the workout because honestly speaking i could not suspend myself in the air like we're eating, right i cannot at this moment but i made the workout my own and i did it in a way that um that was me like it's my workout yeah it is yeah and i made it my own and i did the movement that i felt that i could do but regardless of it i had fun doing it and even with you know my palms i don't know i had blisters on my palm but even despite the pain i was feeling in my palm i was like i'm going to finish strong and this is not to say when you have an injury with your knees or something like that are aching you you should push through an injury like when it's something severe chill like literally chill child breathe stretch cool down drink water mind your business see a doctor get back to the grind 
make funny faces when you get back to the grind whatever it is keep moving and come back every single time come back strong don't roll your mouth and say this is it i quit come back strong come back telling yourself i'm finishing strong that's literally how i how i spoke and i know i said earlier that i was speaking life into myself i literally spoke life to myself and i finished strong and i get that most people cannot do that and most people need people to actually speak life over them and if you have that kind of people around you keep them really really close but then at the same time too you are responsible for your own you know happiness you are you literally are the person carrying your being and your emotions and you literally can tell yourself how to feel at the moment but not that i'm saying at the same time ignore your negative you know feelings or you know your frustrations i'm saying feel those feelings but come back to that table saying you know what i'm a freaking beast i can do this i can do this and do it finish and finish strong and don't forget to give yourself a round of applause and be happy be happy be freaking happy and that is what I consistently pray for each and every one of you. Don't forget to subscribe if this is your first time here. Because we're crazy down here. People that subscribe, they already know. They know. They encounter this madness every day. But I'm glad I can share my madness with you. And if you're slightly unbalanced, not that unbalanced is a bad word, but if you're slightly unbalanced, subscribe because you're subscribing to a fellow unbalanced human being. And let's just be unbalanced together. Thank you. <sighs> This, this is the last workout of my program, uh, and it's 16 minutes. I think it took me 45 minutes to finish that 25 minutes workout, but it's okay. It's okay. It's funny. I'm not producing sweat, but I'm out of breath. Like I feel dry. Hey, it's a nice thing I didn't rub cream. Because man, how that thing hurts. I'm feeling good. I don't know because maybe it's the end. I'm excited. Truly, I'm excited. Let me save some space on my camera and finish this last workout. Hey! Let's get started! She has what? 24 exercises. If this is no wickedness, what is this? In 15 minutes. Nah, this woman deserves an award. She does. Because this is hell. Swim, no worries, let's go for now Let's take it slow Where you go, I go too And if you hit the bottom, I'm going down with you Let's take it slow Who cares where we got I can't believe it <laughs> I really have to whisper But I'm super, super excited I'm done with it, Anuka I legit got blisters so I couldn't do like most of the exercises that were on the ground so I was just like doing, making the exercise my own like jumping jacks, lunges and stuff like that but I'm super super excited that I got to finish I started off the scalp other than the head Woo! I started off all excited then hot then irritated then angry then pumped then just like let's get this over with Man, I feel so dirty. Like, I don't know. Like, my mat is dirty. Like, she's a hot mess. Like, look at that. Dirty. And I just washed it. And I feel so dirty. Like, my footwear, my leggings. For somebody that doesn't like bathing, 
I can't wait to bath, like have a bath, have a shower, like have a bath. You don't get excited about saying bath. I would say like if you're trying to do this, ooh, any of our workouts overall, make sure the environment is conducive, make sure the temperature of the environment you're in is cool, cool enough to do it. Make sure the sun is not hitting you because I can't open my eyes. Where are my glasses, bruh? At the point, I had to even take out my glasses because I was just like, what's going on here? And let me see. Firstly, make sure you do a workout in an environment that you feel like would, you know, motivate you and push you. Because after a while, I was so, so hot. I was not irritated. As I got into the tent, I felt like a lot cooler, a lot like stronger to actually do the workouts. And then make sure you're with music. The problem is, I played the workouts on my phone. And like, you know, like my phone is where my music is. So I couldn't actually work out with it with music. Although like this 2020 summer shred, um, no, it's a two week shred program. Um, this two week shred program is like a lot better than the 2019 one because this had like more interesting songs, I would say. Like more songs that just get you pumping and just powering through. And then she did listen from last year. Like she put in a lot of thought into this workout and made it like hard enough for everybody on each level. Like if you're advanced, she has like mod mod like modifications for advanced people and all that and all that. She actually did take us beginners into consideration. And whenever I felt like um, I couldn't do a particular work, I mean, because my wrist was aching me, I did, you know, the modification. There's, there's nothing wrong with doing it. And with time, you do get stronger to do like, to be on her level so i had to like really really tell myself you know what you're not as strong as you were last year you don't look like how you look last year even at the beginning of this year you don't still look like that but it's okay it truly really, it's okay and it doesn't matter if you're just starting or starting over like the good thing is that you're started and you know i'm a lot stronger than i was last month i can't say that um like last month i couldn't do a push-up like this month at least i could get down four and i'm super super proud of myself and i will get to the level of where i could do like 15 push-ups in 30 seconds and even do more than that um because i do like pushing myself like that like doing a particular workout and trying to do it as best as i can i just have to be like a lot easier on myself but honestly speaking if i can actually do this workout all of it like the four of it i literally can do anything because this was no was no small feat like this was hard it was bloody hard like my cap is dirty like it got to a point i was just even angry with my cap like I don't know what the problem was i was just angry i took off my glasses i even threw away the dumbbells i was like i need to get to the root of my problems <laughs> at the point i was like do you want to even take off your canvas i was like if that's an option i could actually take that route but i'm super super excited that i did this thank you so much for sticking with me and just um, watching it to the very end and i will keep you updated if i make any other progress but i'm super super pumped to do this and definitely not working out tomorrow i'm just going to do a stretch and do, do some um dance workout like just a little bit of cha 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 um tomorrow but nothing intense nothing severe and i don't know this cup is no longer my vibe i'll just wash it and return it to my sister because it's hers after all i don't know metro gypsy was asking me can she have it i was like only if you knew i borrowed it <laughs> Bye!